So as far as uh, beginners, Joanne, what are your recommendations for beginners? Where should they start? You know, what's the best way to really kick this in gear? Okay, this is not the popular answer, but it's the real answer. You have to become friends with drawing. You really do need to start out with, uh, with, with drawing and being comfortable with it. And um, I'm sure in, in the courses that Bill has talked to you about, you know, learning universal shapes, like looking into an object and seeing a cylinder or a sphere. And the difficulty there is most people who, who want to, to learn the lovely oil painting like Jim, like Bill does, is you, you want to jump right in with those beautiful brushes and those great colors. Um, it will be, I, I would just promise you, it will be a lot more fun if you'll, uh, if you'll talk yourself into, into doing some drawing. And, and it doesn't have to be anything formal. I mean, it's just, I, I, heard, I heard something the other day that the definition of an artist uh, is a sketchbook with a person attached. So the little sketchbook can go anywhere with you, and it's not it's not important what you draw. It's just important that that you begin to to learn how to, to the the visual language of drawing. To learn that it's not all about outlines. In fact, it's very little about outlines, and and just get over that. I mean, I I can I can just hear the the words coming in right now. I can't draw. I can't do that. I just want to learn to paint. Learning to paint. And, and learning to paint, paint with great fluidity and, and great impasto, thick paint passages, it's going to be so much more fun for you if you'll do some study with drawing. So that's, that's not a popular answer, but that's the real answer. And it's something that you can learn. You don't have to go for years uh, no. to school. Now, I did have years of drawing. I had uh, at least five years of figure drawing from the model. Um, I had a uh, class that was just drawing the head and those were all from live from models. Uh, I had fashion illustration where we drew from a model, but we had to elongate things. Uh, we had drawing 116. I had all the, the whole gamut of drawing. Um, that was the found. That's how I started. They didn't, we, I didn't start my oil painting classes until I had gone through most of those things. So I agree with Joanna drawing is the foundation. I think it shows up in almost every area of art. If you know how to draw well, it, because really what drawing is, it's not about knowing how to make a mark with a pencil. It's uh, make a line. It's about learning how to uh, see shapes correctly and form and get that, that three-dimensional model in, in your head so that when you're painting it, you know why you're putting a cooler color over here and a warmer over here and lighter somewhere and darker somewhere. Um, you're figuring out form. So it's really, uh, for me too, I did, I did uh, about three years of sculpture professionally where I did a lot of sculptures for a pewter jewelry company. And then I did bronzes, larger ones. And doing that was hugely helpful for me with my drawing skills. Uh, mm -hmm. I did all that in school, but then when I started doing sculpture, Wow, it just exploded because I was seeing everything three-dimensionally and creating it three-dimensionally. And all of a sudden, that put it an, another uh, perspective in my mind, too, with drawing. But it all still goes back to the idea of drawing. It, it, that's the foundation for it all. Do you know of any good uh, courses out right now, Joanna, that, would, that are good for drawing? Are you familiar um, with I, I I really don't. Um... What the what <clears throat> I did look this up. I was I unfortunately had to cancel, but I was going to teach beginning drawing at uh, Southern Vermont Art Center, and I've never taught beginning drawing, and I'm so I, so to to teach it, I sort of had to go back and re-examine my concepts, and I did sort of design what I was going to do, but in the meantime, I did look online for some drawing things, and I looked uh, for some uh, some drawing books. I think there's some some good ones out there. I, I got a few of them. I was disappointed because they were not, they didn't emphasize shapes enough, the concept of shapes. Um, and the ones I saw online, I, I would I would dig a little deeper because they were a lot of shortcut things, and it's not about shortcuts. And I understood that. It, online, if you give somebody a shortcut and it works quickly, that's great and that's going to work really well, and they're going to like their online five-minute experience. But I, uh, shortcuts are not what good drawing is about. So I think Bill including these uh, um, tutorials in, in the future is something you really 
want to look for. I think it's exciting and it certainly is the right way to go.